welcome to Lala's World. Today, I'm going to be breaking down 10 essential financial terms that every beginning investor should know. Understanding these terms is your first step from zero to a million. Let's get started. Term one, stocks. Stocks represent ownership in a company. When you buy a stock, you become a shareholder and own part of that company. Term two, bonds. Bonds are essentially loans you give to companies or governments in exchange for periodic interest payments and the return of the bond's face value at maturity. Term three, ETFs, also known as exchange traded funds. ETFs or exchange traded funds are investment funds that trade on stock exchanges, much like stocks. They hold a collection of assets like stocks, bonds, or commodities. Term four, dividends. Dividends are payments made by a corporation to its shareholders, usually in the form of cash or additional shares as a reward for their investment. Term five, market capitalization. Market capitalization or market cap is the total value of a company's outstanding shares of a stock. It's calculated by multiplying the share price by the total number of shares. Term six, P-E ratio, also known as price to earnings ratio. The P-E ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earning. It's a key indicator of a company's valuation. Term seven, bull market and bear market. A bull market refers to a period when a stock prices are rising, while the bear market is when stock prices are falling. These terms reflect the overall market sentiment. Term eight, diversification. Diversification is the practice of spreading investments across various assets due to reduced risk. It helps protect your portfolio from market volatility. Term nine, compound interest. Compound interest is the interest on a loan or deposit calculated based on both the initial principal and accumulated interest from previous periods. Term 10, asset allocation. Asset allocation is the process of dividing your investment portfolio among several assets, categories such as stocks, bonds, and cash to balance risk and reward according to your goals. And there you have it. 10 financial terms that can help you on your understanding and your journey from zero to a million. And understanding these concepts are crucial for making informed investment decisions. In general, if you're looking to get to a million investing, it is possible. And I would recommend starting early to take advantage of compound interest, set clear financial goals, and save a significant portion of your income regularly. Educate yourself on investment options like stock bonds and real estate and 401ks. Diversify your portfolio across various asset classes to reduce your risk, including growth, stocks, index funds, and real estate properties. Reinvest your earnings, such as dividends, interest, and rental income to maximize your growth. Minimize fees and taxes by choosing low-fee investment options like utilizing tax-advantaged accounts like your 401k and IRAs. Monitor and adjust your portfolio regularly to stay aligned with your goals, rebalancing it as needed. Stay disciplined. Avoid making impulse decisions based on market fluctuation and remain patient for long-term growth. Understanding key financial terms like stocks, bonds, ETFs, Dividends, market capitalization, P.E. ratio, bull and bear markets, diversification, compound interest, and asset allocation will aid in making informed investment decisions. Well, thanks for watching. Be sure to like, share, subscribe, and check out the other videos on this channel.